Welcome back. This is Rito here with another Terraria Journey's End Weapon Showcase. Today we're going to be looking at a really highly requested weapon. It is the Desert Biome Chest weapon. They've added another biome chest in the dungeon. And in order to obtain this weapon, you need to farm up a Desert Key. And this Desert Key is a 1 in 2500 chance in dropping from any Desert Enemy in hard mode. So it will take quite a while to farm this up unless you're very lucky. So I recommend using lots of battle potions, water candles, anything you can do to boost spawn rate. Once you have your desert key, you'll need to defeat Plantera so you can open the chests in the dungeon. Then you just need to find your desert chest and you will be able to obtain the awesome Desert Tiger Staff. The Desert Tiger Staff is a summoning weapon. It says it's got average knockback, uses 10 mana, and it summons a white tiger to fight for you. With all the gear that I have currently, the damage is showing 66 summon damage. And I'm using the Tiki armor so we don't have super overpowered Stardust armor messing with the damage calculations. So let's go ahead and summon the little tiger and see what it looks like. You can see it's really cute. And wow, it jumps and attacks things. It's very aggressive. I like that they made summons a lot more aggressive. So it jumps right on them and does tons of damage. Pretty sweet, it's doing like 70, 75 damage. Yeah, it's doing pretty good. So let's go ahead and see how this would do on some bosses. Let's summon the Eye of Cthulhu and see how it does on the Eye of Cthulhu. So I'm gonna go ahead and whip it so it targets the Eye of Cthulhu. And yeah, it's doing pretty well. It's doing like 400 damage per second. Honestly, for being a biome chest, I was expecting it to be able to kill this boss a little bit quicker. It kind of is getting stuck because it's not being able to fly as much. So maybe if we stay closer to the ground, it's struggling trying to hit the Eye of Cthulhu. So I guess that might not be the best boss to try it on. Let's try it on something a little bit easier for the tiger, like the King Slime. So yeah, let's see if it can do a little bit better on this. Okay, so now it's doing like a thousand damage per second. Yeah, it's doing much better in that circumstance. I think the Eye of Cthulhu was just too fast for the tiger. Now I wanna see how this would do on something like the destroyer. So let's try to target the destroyer here. It's doing like a thousand damage per second. Yeah, this is uh, struggling a little bit. But I'm sure we can summon several other summons to go with it. So this is just one of many summons that you could be using at this point in the game. It didn't do very well against the destroyer, so I whipped out a different weapon to finish off the destroyer. But yeah, it does pretty good at just killing enemies as you run. For how much farming you'll have to do in order to obtain this little tiger, I think it's a little bit underpowered, but it is really cool and it's really cute. I think it'd be kind of a fun thing to use if you're doing like a melee or ranger or mage and you just want to have kind of a familiar or a pet that runs behind you and actually does some damage. It's not going to do much damage, but it's kind of cool to have a little tiger to, you know, run around and do damage. So I think it's a cool weapon, although it's not something that's going to really improve your loadout that much at this point in the game. And that concludes our showcase of the new Desert Tiger Staff. It's pretty cool. You just need to get the key, open the chest in the dungeon after defeating Plantera, and you can have an awesome tiger that runs behind you and attacks all the enemies. I hope you all have found this video informative and enjoyable. If you have, be sure to like and subscribe. I'm also posting lots of other Terraria 1.4 content, so be sure to check out my other videos if you're interested in seeing more weapon and item showcases. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.